Good day, everyone. This discussion will talk about Samson and Laub's age-graded theory. Robert Samson and John H. Laub created the age-graded theory of informal social control. It is a developmental theory because it is looking the behavior across life. It is not just examining what happens in one stage or point of life, but instead it is related in one's past and tries to see how different decisions, opportunities, and choices impacts the criminal behavior. It explains that major life events can increase or decrease the criminal behavior. Negative life events have the tendency to increase both the intensity or frequency of those criminal deviant actions. The life course perspectives use the concepts of trajectories, transitions, and turning points. So what is trajectories? Trajectories is the pathways or lines of development such as work life, parenthood, marriage, and criminal behavior. Transitions, on the other hand, is the short-term events embedded in trajectories which may include starting a new job, getting married, having a child, or being sentenced in prison. Since this too is related to each other, transitory events may lead to turning points or changes in an individual's life such as good relationship and good job. For example, Alex comes from a broken family where he experienced the abuse from his father which he already did to his classmates. When he became an adult, he married someone who are capable of handling things and they built a strong relationship. The marriage that he has is considered a turning point which decreases his criminal behavior. Samson and Love's age graded theory of informal social control introduced three themes. First is structural context. It predicts that family and social bonding will mediate the effects of structural background on delinquency. Second is cumulative continuity. It explains the correlation between adolescent, delinquency, and adult crime. The best predictor of criminal behavior is prior criminal behavior. And lastly, Informal social control in adulthood explains changes in criminal behavior over lifespan. Adult social ties are important as they create interdependent systems of obligation and restraint to criminal action. Samson and Laub suggest that development is best conceived of as a constant interaction between individuals, their environment, social interactions, and random processes. That is all about Samson and Laub's age-graded theory of informal social control. I hope you learned something. Thank you!